So this route master was first registered in 1962. It's actually older than that, the body is 1958. Uh, it was in service in London uh, till 2005. Uh, I, when we would, uh, when I was running Transport for London, we withdrew the last route masters. I bought it 10 years ago, 2007. I had it completely done up. And it's quite a famous bus. I've driven into and out of uh, Buckingham Palace with it. Prince Charles has been on the back. The uh, Duke of Cambridge, Duke, Duke of Industrial Cambridge, Prince Harry had the uh, last Prime Minister on it. And it does, well, it probably does 20, 30,000 miles a year. A couple of years ago, I suddenly thought that actually we weren't moving fast enough when I was at Transport for London with a London bus fleet in repowering to get the latest emission friendly engines. So I thought, well, if you can repower the oldest bus on the road, more or less, like this, with a Euro 6 environmentally friendly engine, you can do anything. So I talked to Cummins, they were very enthusiastic. We had this new engine fitted in at the spring of 2016. I think it's been a real success, both technically, people are fantastically interested. But it's really making a point that the oldest vehicle you can imagine can be fitted with the most modern engine and exhaust after treatment. And I think that that proves that you can engineer, with modern diesel engines, you can engineer something which meets the latest environment, mentally friendly standards, and still fits in an, in an iconic old vehicle like this one. Well, do you know what, I've been trying for, ever since I've owned it, I've been trying to find out where it is, because generally I don't drive it. I have thought about fitting GPS systems, but of course this new Cummins Connected Diagnostic System not only tells me what the engine's doing and whether it needs any attention, which it doesn't generally, it also tells me where the bus is, so that's a huge plus. I'm really pleased with that, I can find out where the bus is on my mobile phone.